I'm here with my girlfriends. We are on a girls trip and we're going to a vision summit, a vision seminar. And we're just here having fun, bonding, and joining us for the weekend. Welcome, 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 welcome. If you're new here, my name is Patrice, the Patrice Denise, and I am living a healthy, sustainable lifestyle, one day at a time, one step at a time. And this weekend is about visions, about goals, about bonding with friends and family, and just continuing on with developing the whole me. First, I just want to um, thank you guys for your love and your support in the last video and um all that you <laughs> right you hear me over here yes, they interrupted me they see me over here doing my intro <laughs> but i thank you guys for your love and your support for um my family my husband especially we are still going through my husband he was okay with me coming on this girl trip because it was already planned um and the services for my father-in-law are not until next week so he was okay with me still coming on this trip and what i am finding we'll talk about it we'll talk about it some more but what i'm finding what i'm learning is that you got to continue to live life um because of the simple fact that you don't know you know when you don't know when so you have to continue to live life and like i said my husband's okay with it and he was um equally thankful for your love and your support but yep we are out here at the embassy suites And we're just chilling out. I'm about to go to a seafood restaurant, so I'll take you guys along with us. For that, we just got here. So we're talking. So I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. next morning and I am up early it is now seven o'clock well actually seven o one to be exact and I've done my Bible study my I wrote my prayer journal and just getting up early during um, the day for me really helps to set the day it really helps me to, to you know be able to be at peace and talk with God but also I just feel that God really wanted me to um, be able to, to, to be intimate with him during this time in order to be stronger for my family, you know, during the time that we are going through right now. It's just, I, I, I'm just uh, amazed at what God is doing and the revelations that he has given during this time. Um, he just puts everything in place and he lets us do things that we're supposed to do in order to get through this journey called life. But yeah, so it's the next morning, and I'm about to go wake up my girlfriend, and we're going to go into the gym and get some exercise in. Last night, we went to Juicy Crab, and it was good, but I, doubting Juicy Crab, I ordered the hot flavor, and um, yeah, it was, it was hot, definitely was hot, 
and um, I'm gonna go back to my mild flavor for my little crab boils. I don't know what flavor you get or what spice level you get, but that hot was too hot. <laughs> but then afterwards, we did go to McDonald's. <laughs> we sat in the lawn at McDonald's, and we got some cookies. Um, Cause people, he had a little sweet tooth. And if you don't already know, I do document my health journey as well on this channel. And um, I took my blood sugar this morning, and you'll see that in a, another video, or I'll talk about it in another video. But um, I took my blood sugar this morning, it was 104, 106, 106, 106. So still within range, you know, good range, but I, it was, it is a little higher than what it has been. And, and it was because of the, the cookie, so that's okay. That's okay. Um, yeah, everything in moderation. Y'all know how I do. Y'all know how I do. But we're going to go to the gym, get that in, and then we're going to go to um, the retreat and or the seminar. It's called Resolute, and it's about visions and goal setting and just getting your life, you know, prepared and on track to accomplish those goals. The uh, event host, she stands by the fact that she does start things, but she finishes things. And so that's a good model to take, um, being that you you might have some visions and goals that you wanna accomplish, but it's all in continuing and accomplishing those visions and those goals. So I'm excited to see what um, this seminar is about today. But all right, let's go to the gym, let's go to the gym. about to go down to um get something to eat so before we go get something to eat i want to show y'all my earrings so remember in the last maybe the last video i'm not sure but remember in the other video i showed you the nabby chic earring so this is the last pair besides this one that i had on yesterday did y'all see the ones yesterday see so pretty they're like flower petals and then these are flowers as well so i'm gonna put these on and remember you can go to Nabby Chic's website, I'll link it down below, and use the discount code NBDENISE, and you can get 10% off your order up until July the 11th of 2024. Again, this is a jewelry wholesale company who has uh, inexpensive jewelry, and from what I'm seeing on their site, is it is good for if you have to order a lot of jewelry and um, you want, you know, I wouldn't say cheap, but you want a very inexpensive price. So, we are going to get something to eat. We're at the Embassy Suites, and you know they have the best breakfast. So, I'm going to go get an omelet, maybe some oatmeal. What y'all getting? I'm getting an omelet. Omelet. Uh, omelet, and probably some peas. Something like yeah. that. Yeah. We had a good workout this morning, so. And then later on, we're going to be fed again, but mind and spiritually. Going shopping before we head to the seminar. We always gotta go to the store. <laughs> These were only twelve dollars. I tried them on and they fit too. Probably a regular because it was a seven and a half. Valentine's Day is here. Well, not here yet. It's still in January, but they got all the, all the stuff out. For Valentine's Day. Let me show y'all what I got from TJ Maxx. Well, first, I got a toothbrush. So I forgot my toothbrush at home. <laughs> so I got a toothbrush. And then I got this spray. Because I've seen on somebody's video. I forgot who it was. But they had the pink stuff and I've never seen it before. So I wanted to see how it works. So I got some of that. This was $7.99.
We made it here. So we are at the Resolute Goal Setting Workshop and it is by hosted by Dr. Sally Ann Gray. She does have a training company. A business is Gray Focus Training Solutions and she focuses on like is helping people to reach their goals. Like I said before, she is um, one who says that she sets out to do things and she completes them and she's about to help others complete their their visions and their goals too. So I'm excited about this. It says improve your mindsets, create your goals, and take action. So this is very, oh, and it says have a productive year. So this will definitely help us to continue to stay on track in 2024 because what is our theme? Do not give up in 2024. So we're going to continue on, continue on. Oh, I'm so excited. So like I said, this is the registration time, and it's going to start here in a second. So I'll tell you about it. All right, so we are at lunch, but or it's lunchtime, but the first speaker she spoke, and well, the event pool she spoke, and then the first speaker she spoke, well, the keynote speaker spoke, but let me tell you, this is about you. Don't we talk about that all the time? It's about us, and it's about putting us first, priorities, making time for ourselves first, and then we can pour into others. So we're going to talk. We're going to talk more about this and, and, and everything that went on, but put you first, and then you will be able to pour into others, But because we can't pour into others if we, we're empty. We're going to talk about it some more. So we are leaving the conference and I just wanted to come back and let y'all know this was beautiful. This was beautiful. This is, you know, God just be working in mysterious ways and he is always on time. So I asked for confirmation this morning during my prayer time and my Bible study time and he gave me just that during this conference and I am just thankful and so amazed at what he is doing in my life. So, though, like I said, the title of the, the conference was um, Resolute, and Resolute means purposeful, determined, and unwavering. So, that goes along with our theme. Don't give up. We're not giving up in 2024. We are purposeful, we are determined, and we are unwavering. We're not stopping. We're not giving up in 2024. And so there's a lot of things that he confirmed in there today, and I just want to continue on. And so there's a lot of goals, more goals, more things, more visions. And so, oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. So I'm going to share that with you guys throughout 2024, so y'all stay with me. But I know that there's some things that you want to do in 2024, health-wise, just personal goals, financial goals, business goals. We talked about that. Oh, it's cold out here. <laughs> we talked about that before in our uh, vision and goals uh, video. But just being purposeful being determined, unwavering. So, okay, I'm walking up, cars are coming. What do you want to do in 2024? We are going to be resolute. Oh. We are finally in the car after the conference and we are just processing everything and from that great conference. So what is something that y'all learned from the conference? Um, I learned to let God use you, ask God for what you want, and also be accountable to achieving the goals that He has laid before you and to live life to its fullest. I've learned that you have to go ahead when you set your goals, you have to go through them, process them, but always have God first when you are setting your goals. So God, I want to say that He has to be the head of your life when you're doing your goals and everything will come through. I learned to just do it. Set the goals and do it. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. So there's something in all of you. There's something in all of us. Whatever's inside of us, we're going to pull it out. We're going to do it. We're going to accomplish it because we're going to set goals. And we're going to, little small goals. Y'all know how I go. Little small changes, small goals, and it equals big results. So all of 2024, we're not giving up. Yes. We're going to keep doing what we're supposed to be doing. We're going to yes. keep striving. We're going to keep working on ourselves. Oh, and that's another thing. It's about you. Working on you and what do you say? The circle? Yep. Put the a circle, circle around yourself. Put the circle Work around yourself. You. Don't and focus on other people, focus on self. Oh, I love it. I love it. Bye. <laughs> Let's go to Hobby Hobby.
We're about to head home, about to get in the car. All right, what did you learn from the oh, well, conference today? I had a great time at the conference, and my mantra, first of all, is going to be consistent. See, be consistent. So that's my goal, one of my goals for 2024. I love it, I love it. <laughs> We made it back home. Everybody's home and safe with their family. So, um, yeah, that was a good, good, good conference. It talked about resolute, which means um, unwavering, determined, purposeful. And as we set forth in 2024 and beyond, we need to be resolute. So all that this came right on time. The Lord knows when you need things to help to fire you back up to get you to uh, remember your why and to remember why you're doing things and uh, my purpose and my why is to motivate others and to motivate my family and my friends and just um, you because you are my family and my friends um, this community of people that we have here so we're going to continue to be resolute in 2024 continue to not give up in 2024 so um, with that being said I have a lot of work to do we have a lot of work to do so I have some bigger goals that I now want to accomplish, not necessarily in 2024, but maybe in the next two years. I have something I want to do in the next two years. So stay tuned for that. I have a lot of growth and expansion that I want to happen in 2024 and in 2025 and in 2026 and beyond. I uh, have a lot of increase that I want to occur in those years as well and beyond. So we got a lot of work to do. We got a lot of work to do, and we're going to continue to do it. So I thank y'all, as always, for being with me. Hope something in this video resonated with you. If not, just the word resolute. Look it up if you need to or whatnot, and um, just kind of dwell on that and ponder on that. But again, I thank you for your love and your support with my uh, family and for my husband. And I appreciate you guys. I always, always, always do. I look forward to continuing 2024 and beyond with you guys. I just love this community of people that we have here. We are accountability partners. We are just loving on each other and motivating each other. And I appreciate that. And I thank you guys. <sighs> we got a lot of work to do. I got some goals that I want to get accomplished. And I'm going to start working on them. So I'm working on them. And, and they're just, you know, bigger than health goals. Um, so I want to focus and dive deep into... My Facebook for this channel. I really haven't paid that much attention, so I want to do that more. I want to focus on, and when I say focus on the Facebook, just like sending out positive messages throughout the day or throughout the month and things like that. Um, maybe we can share recipes on that, that there as well, stuff like that. Just, you know, fun things over there to bring people in as well. Um, I just want to be able to create generational wealth. That's always a great thing for us to do for our family. So I want to get, you know, dive deeper into that and how I can uh, accomplish that. I want to, I eventually, I want to write a book. So, yes, I'm, I'm speaking it. The Bible says you should speak it as though it, it already is. And so I am speaking it. I'm going to write a book, maybe not in 2024, but I will write it within the next two years. And, um, yeah, we're going to do this. We're not giving up. So I thank you guys for joining me again. I love you guys and God bless.